And I woke up early today because I have a really long day and a lot to do and a few important meetings and things. So I woke up early so that I could get in the shower, do the Dyson, and prepare before I have some meetings today. I also have a fun campaign to shoot, which I need to also do today, which is why I want to have my hair dyson Um and tomorrow we leave for Florida, which is so exciting. So I also have to get everything packed up and everything squared away here before we head out tomorrow. But I woke up with a little bit of a headache, so I just took some Advil because today is not the day to be feeling not the best because I just, I have a very important meeting starting at 9 a.m. and then another kind of important one later today. And then just regular, vacation prep things and then I also have a campaign to shoot so today was not the day for that so we took Advil just made my coffee and now I'm gonna go jump in the shower I remember being in grade school and we always would just shower before bed and for some reason I had to shower that morning and I remember just not wanting to get out because it was just like so warm and cozy and then I was running to the bus because I spent too long in the shower so that's why I now I always shower at night because I just never want to get out but it felt really good to clean my hair it was going on like three day four day hair so that felt good but I'm just gonna do some skincare and do my hair care and then we'll start getting ready for the day. This right here is just my favorite part of the day. It's still dark out. Well, it's starting to get a little light now, but it's so cozy with the light. It's so calm and quiet. through my curls and start to brush out the pieces I feel like I did a decent job today um, yeah that's what that looks like and that took 30 minutes exactly I started at 7 30 and it is now 8 so this took exactly 30 minutes which is not bad at all I feel like it looks really pretty and Here's what the back looks like. Who knows how good the back is actually going to look. But that is the Dyson blowout. Y'all, it's a little bit later now. I just got 
done with my well it's not really that much later i just got done with my first meeting and it went so well there are so many exciting things happening right now and i've been trying to stay positive because i've mentioned i've been going through a little bit of a hard time but i'm just trying to show up and say like today's gonna be a good day good things happened to me and it's been happening good things have been happening to me every day has been really good the past couple of days so i'm just trying to stay positive um but had a really good meeting I'm about to jump into another meeting right now um, with a few people on my team to go over a few things and then um, we have a little bit of work to finish up because i'm taking tomorrow and friday off because we're heading to florida and then friday i just took off we get one friday off a month at my company which is really nice so i took that on friday so we have a nice long weekend in florida to look forward to um, but I just have some last minute things to finish up for the week. I have a podcast to publish today and yeah, it's going to be a great day. I'm excited and I'm really excited to um, film a little campaign later. I'll definitely bring you guys along that process, but I'm really excited because I get to film with my little Gigi girl. She's so cute. All right, you guys, I just finished and wrapped all of my meetings for the day. They all went really well and I'm really happy with everything some good things are coming that's all i'm gonna say like a really exciting really exciting day um but i am now just making a quick lunch i'm really happy that all the meetings are done and now i can focus on the campaign that i need to shoot today and then also finalize the rest of my work for the week and then pack and prep for florida so excited i like cannot wait um but right now i'm just heating up some leftovers this looks gross, but this is the chuck roast that I made in the last vlog. That was on Monday. Today's Wednesday. So I'm just heating that up for a quick little lunch. And then I'm going to head to my parents so I can film my campaign. I don't know if I mentioned it earlier, but it's the campaign that I um, am working on with Aerie. I've been working with them. I'm in a four-month partnership. So um, I have to film that. And little Gigi is going to be in it. So excited for that and I'm excited to see my parents because I haven't seen them since Saturday so my parents are like my best friends I love them so much so I'm excited to do that um, and get that done that's just gonna be a huge weight lifted off my shoulders and then yeah after that it's just gonna be me um, getting the rest of my work done for today which hopefully shouldn't take too long and then I'm gonna spend the rest of the night just packing up and getting everything laid out for tomorrow because we're flying out of cleveland at 7 a.m so we have to leave here like around 3 45 4 so that we can park the car and like get into the terminal with enough time um so whenever i have to leave for a really early morning flight i have everything laid out and packed and ready to go so luckily i already like washed my hair this morning and have it styled so like i'm just gonna take a body shower tonight and then tomorrow i'll be like ready to go i'll have all my skincare and everything laid out so i can do my skincare throw it into my bag and then put it in my carry-on um or my personal item i guess and then like my suitcase will be totally packed closed up zipped by the door i'll have my coffee prepped for the morning because i'm gonna need that um so everything i'll have everything laid out because i just i hate i hate rushing in general like my least favorite thing ever is rushing i hate it like literally it stresses me out so much and i just it's the worst feeling in the world so like i hate rushing so especially when traveling rushing when traveling is 10 times worse so getting everything packed and prepped and ready to go all of my like chargers everything just in my carry-on and like totally ready to go I have the bays um carry-on set so i have the carry-on and then like the little bag and it fits so much stuff it's so nice so i'm really happy that i got that i got that this summer and it just has been amazing because i'm only taking a carry-on we're going for two weeks but um uh, we're just doing carry-ons so that's what i'm doing um hopefully everything fits i have everything all laid out actually i guess i could show you instead of me just standing here talking to you so yesterday i went through and started just laying everything out from activewear shoes hats like a beach bag um like a few fancier outfits like i feel like it's gonna be a pretty laid back trip so mostly like loungewear and activewear for the day like for during the days and then a few like nice outfits at night 
So I have everything laid out. Hopefully I can fit this all in a carry on. And then I have my like underwear laid out, socks. Then I started laying out like my Kindle, a few of the chargers and things that I need. And then I really want to read this book. I have yet to start it. Um, but this is the last book I read. Absolutely loved it. Um, so everything is laid out for the most part. The only thing I have to pack is toiletries. And then of course there's only, there's a few things that have to be packed like the morning of like my skincare and my toothbrush. So I will just have everything laid out in the bathroom. I actually did get a few like cute little travel size things for this trip. Actually really only one new thing, but I have a whole little section in my bathroom where I keep all of my travel size stuff. So for this trip specifically, I did treat myself to a cute little travel size of the Necessaire body wash. Um, and I'm like, wait, 3.4 ounces. Is that the travel size size or is it three? I never know like if it's three or if it's 3.4. So we're going to bring this. Hopefully it's okay. And then I love Davines shampoo and conditioner. So I have the baby sizes of those, which I'm going to have to, that does not look like it's going to be enough conditioner. So I'm going to have to like combine a few things, but I am bummed out because, oh my God, wait, why do I have three of these? What the heck? Why do I have three of these mini conditioners? I don't know what's going on. Um, but I'm going to have to lay this all out still because I haven't thought about it yet. But I love getting like, like I have my hair oil in a mini, which is helpful. So I'm going to have to go through and lay that all out and package it up. But that shouldn't take too long. Um, but yeah, it's just like that kind of stuff. And then my supplements and the other things I want to bring are like the big things. And then I want to run in the mornings there. I just... There's something about like running in Florida. I don't know. Every time I go to Florida, I like get back into running, which I mean, like I definitely am a runner, but it's, I don't get into it in the winter. That's for sure. So I'm going to pack up my running band and like my Apple watch and my AirPods. Um, so that's the tea on that. And I can't wait to see Gidget. Oh my gosh. I've been talking for like four hours straight this morning. So I'm going to sit down and I'm going to eat this, oh, it's hot, and then pack up, head to my parents, and I'll see you guys then. I'm actually touching up my makeup right now before I go to my parents and shoot, and I thought I would just quickly, well, first chat through how I kind of touch up my makeup, because it's after 1 o'clock now, and I've had this makeup on since like 7.30 this morning, so how I kind of fix it and just like refresh it especially because i'm about to film a video and then i also want to talk about uh the giveaway for this video okay so whenever i go through and like touch up makeup i always like to blot my face with a piece of toilet paper i don't have those like oil blotting sheets i feel like you don't need them just you know toilet paper works so i always do that and then i have a little bit of like a mascara smudge for some reason which that drives me insane Sometimes my mascara will come down to like the bottom of my eye. It drives me insane. So I'm just gonna like wipe that up. Um, but I always start with first refreshing my under eyes. So I do the Tula Rose Glow and get it. I use this every single day. I love it so much. I use it with makeup, over makeup, under makeup. Um, it's skincare, so I'll use it like even if I'm not wearing makeup that day, I always put it on my nose too. Um, and it really lays nicely over makeup. So I always will do that to like refresh first and foremost. After that, I take my concealer. I use the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. Just kidding. This is the NARS Soft Matte Concealer in Medium One Custard. So I take this. It's a pot concealer. It is fairly matte. It's not like totally matte. Um, and then I use this Sephora Concealer Brush. In the number 57 and I just put a little bit on the brush and then I go anywhere that just needs a little bit more coverage or if it wore off in any areas I was also wearing my glasses so I get eye marks very easily so I'm just gonna cover that up um, on my chin after that I take this Tarte brush I love it and I just make sure that everything is blended out and it looks seamless this brush is like also one of my all-time favorite brushes. And then after that, I'm just gonna 
go through and reset everything. This is the Kosas Cloud Set. Mine is like almost gone. I broke the lid off. I love this powder so much. I'm like nervous that I'm gonna run out while I'm in Florida and I like probably should plan on bringing one of my other powders if that happens. But I just go around and set my face. To bring a little color back, I'm just going in with some more of my bronzer. This is the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Bronzer in Luminous Bronze Light. So I just go in like a three shape here. I go like on my eyelid a little bit and I'm just making sure everything looks really seamless and blended. Again, I'm going in with Hourglass Blush. This is the color Subline Flush. And I really like it. And this is basically my last step. I'm just gonna go in and make sure all of my eyebrows, like I'm gonna go over with clear brow gel. And then that's it. For clear brow gel, I have the Benefit one, but I also really like this Essence one. It's like a few bucks and it's just a clear brow gel and it really does a nice job. So I really do like Essence. Like it's a very affordable makeup brand, but they make really good stuff so there's that and then i'm gonna just bring my lip liner and i'm gonna do my lips there but that is how i refresh my makeup and we're just looking a little more video ready just have to wait until the lines on my nose from my glasses go away but that's what that is looking like and for today's giveaway i thought it would be fun to give away a stanley so these are the two Stanleys that I have. I have this one that I just use for like my everyday water bottle that I keep at my desk on my nightstand. So like this is my like house Stanley. And then I have this Stanley with the lid, not the lid. Yeah, I guess it is the lid, but it's the, has a little spout and you can put it down. And this is the one I take for my workout. So this one, I don't really carry it around the house. I just use it for my workout. So a very good workout one because it has the handle. And then this is a very good one for like around the house. So um, if you would like to enter, leave a comment down below on what you would like to see more of on my channel. Um, if it's more vlogs, what do you want to see in the vlogs? And if you have requests for any other types of videos, put that down there as well. Um, so just leave a comment saying what you want to see more of here and leave your Instagram handle so I can reach out to you and ask you which Stanley you want and then I can get your address and send it that way. Um, again, thank you guys so much for being here and watching my videos. Like it just... It means the world to me and I cherish each and every single one of you. So that is today's giveaway. Um, I think I'm all ready. I just need to switch my sweater. I'm gonna put on jeans also so that, I don't know, it just looks a little better. Cause right now I'm in sweatpants. Um, and that's it. I feel like today has been so busy already. <sighs> I need a second. I can't wait until it's like five o'clock and I can like been a busy day. In the car now, I was actually just walking out and I had a package for me, which thank God this came to me because I needed it for Florida. I ordered a new deodorant and I've never tried this brand before. It's the Salt and Stone and I got the Santal and Vetiver. I think that's how you say it. So I'm really happy this came because I needed a new deodorant and this is like a clean deodorant. I don't think there's, um, any like heavy metals in here and I don't think it's an, an antiperspirant so ooh okay I like that I actually um didn't wear any deodorant today because I don't have any so I really like the way that that smells I'm putting it on now so I don't stink up the joint but I'm heading to my parents now oh my god this car is crazy I've had like a little bit of car trouble over the past couple of weeks which has been funny. Um, both of my windshield wipers like flew off. One flew off and I replaced it. And then thank God I didn't replace the other one yet because a few days later that one flew off. So I currently have one of mine just like sticking up because it doesn't have the wiper on it. And I do actually like, I have the wiper. Like I have, this is the empty one, but I have it to replace it. I just haven't done it yet. And then also my starter was being weird and my dad had to like get on the ground at Marshall's and help fix it but he fixed it and then I need to get that looked at probably and then also my power steering 
probably needs like a new, I think it's like fluid, I don't know, but listen to this. Like that's the, I think it's the power steering, I don't know. So the car needs some TLC, but we're not worried about that right now. Um, it'll be fine <laughs> until I get back from Florida, but I'm heading to my parents now, I'm gonna put on some music. Um, I received some more great news within the last half an hour. The last time I had the camera, I received more good news. I'm like, wait, today's such a great day. Oh my, I swear if you wake up and say like, today will be a good day, I know that sounds so cheesy, but like good things freaking happen. So, I'm happy. And listen to some Morgan and head out. Tell me this is not the cutest thing you've ever seen. Do you love it? Video is filmed. It was so cute. I loved filming that with her. She looked adorable. And the video came out cute. I actually just sat downstairs on the couch and edited it. And it turned out really cute. So I'm going to send that in for approval. I think they're really going to like it. Um, but I'm still in the pajamas. They're really cute. And I'm going to get changed and head back home now. I still have a little bit of work to finish up. And then we're gonna pack up my suitcase. Um, I think we're just gonna do like leftovers for dinner tonight because we don't have any more groceries. I only bought stuff to make like two dinners. So I'm gonna head home, check in with Seth, see what's going on and start packing up. I'm all showered up back home now in my jammies and I'm actually just putting together a quick dinner. I am just doing <laughs> breakfast for dinner. So I'm making some eggs. I've been doing this technique where you make like the slow, like soft cooked eggs. And then I have a blueberry pancake. And then I'm also descaling my Keurig because I recently just broke the Keurig back out. So I'm just working on descaling that and cooking up some eggs. These eggs are so good. You just put it on low and then you just stir them around into like these little curds <laughs> start to form. And it is so good i after i had these ones i'm like i can never eat eggs another way it's really really yummy um but now i'm just scaling the keurig rinsing it with vinegar and running it through all right my suitcase is packed and by the door i have all of my toiletries all ready to go i'm gonna need a few of them in the morning so i'm just gonna like package up my toothbrush and my skincare and everything like that in the morning after I have it all or after I use it in the morning and now I'm just running out to my car <laughs> I just threw on like some random clothes because I have to run out and get my sunglasses because I totally forgot my sunglasses are in the car so yeah we're all packed up it's around 8 p.m. now which is nice so we got done kind of early I hate overhead lighting at night um so I'm about to get my sunglasses and then literally get in bed and then we have to wake up at like 3 20 3 30 it's gonna be brutal but it's exciting because we're going to florida so i'm gonna end off the vlog here don't forget to enter the giveaway and leave a comment below about what you want to see on my channel i already took a melatonin so i'm like starting to get sleepy but thank you guys so much for being here and i will see you in the next one bye guys